On to my second day of Jim Wendler's 531 Boring But Big Plan. This day, the target lift is deadlift. And prior to my first round of starting strength, I had never deadlifted in my life. Of course, I'd always seen people doing deadlifts, but it looked like a backbreaker to me, so I never tried it. When I finally did do the deadlift with starting strength, it became my favorite lift, probably due to the rapid progress I made. Getting true measurable results like daily PRs on the deadlift is a lot of fun. I remember when I hit sticking points at 315 pounds and later at 405 pounds when I wondered if I had reached my limits, but I kept going and pushed past my plateaus. I have hit five plates or 495 pounds for one just one time at a strongman competition i failed at 495 but it was only about a month later that i finally actually did hit it during training so this is my second day on jim wendler's 531 boring but big program and honestly it feels like i'm using baby weight my first set of five was 285 for five the next set was 325 and then there was an AMRAP set of 375 pounds and on the AMRAP I got 10 and honestly I think that the reason that I stopped that set was because my lungs I think it was more of a cardiovascular vascular problem not my muscles so next I was doing these sets of 225 for 10 reps each and this was easy but tiring on my lungs again so after that, you know, after uh, these, then I'm going to move on to some ab work, which was funny. So You know, from looking at it right now, my face looks like it's terribly uh, painful. No, that's my, not my face, that's my butt. But it was super easy. This is my, like, I usually just, I don't even warm up with, 225 anymore. I usually warm up with 315 um, before I start moving up. So, but I finished all five sets for 10 reps and it was no problem. So moving on, I haven't done any ab work for it's probably been at least a year since I've done any ab work at all. And so now it's kind of funny that it's in this program it's a strength pro program for intermediates, and here I'm doing ab work. So, yep. Kind of boring. All right, and then after that, I'm going to go and do some curls. And so the curls, I just add on to the program uh, just to get some extra arm work in. My arms are always a lagging body part. And maybe that's because my form isn't as good as some guy in the comments uh, would like it to be. Um, he said that I was leaning all the way back. I'm not sure that I am. I mean, there's a couple, a couple of these sets um, or these reps. Looks like I do lean a, bit, a little bit more, but... I mean, your body's going to shift because of the weight moving around in front of it. Uh, maybe somebody else can tell me what an idiot I am and how that these are all cheat reps. But afterwards, I think my biceps are sore and they're pumped and everything. So I I think it's okay. And it's only it's ninety five pounds. I've I've done more than that. So I guess maybe my form is even worse on on the larger. So then I'm on to the. Uh, just two sets of each, two sets of biceps, two sets of triceps. But I'm going to do it after every workout. So it's four days a week that I'll be doing this two sets of biceps and two sets of triceps. So that's uh, that's going to be the whole the whole enchilada for the day two. So I'm hoping that the rest of this you know feels heavier. I'd, I'd say that this is pretty easy, but that I'm planning on some other stuff. So and. Uh, there's my wife and my daughter. They are doing their exercise, which is a little bit easier than mine. So, thanks for watching.